All right, so I would like to make an experiment, so a bug or feature experiment, and uh, what I'm interested in is um, the difference between charcoal and coal generated by the by the solid generator. And um, what I'm especially interested in is if I want to capture the gas uh, that is uh, exhausted from the solid generator. Um, what kind of temperature uh, should I expect uh, from the coal and from the um, charcoal? Right, let's see how this works. So we put a piece of coal into the solid generator. And as you can see, this, the coal generates gas uh, in the 200 uh, C degree, uh, uh, um, um, Celsius degree range. Right, so very nice. Let's see how this, uh, we purge this gas. And let's see what is the difference uh, between coal and charcoal. Right, so give me your back. And yeah, I would like to have this uh, video for a reference uh, so I can check later, maybe changes to the solid generator. And right, so charcoal. And this is interesting. As you can see, charcoal generates 400 uh, degree Celsius. And uh, if you consider on Venus, 200 degree for coal is, is a very valuable uh, temperature. Uh, especially um, the solid generator generates uh, CO2 and uh, pollutant. The pollutant you could, could use for your cooling system. Uh, you could easily uh, use uh, one or two ACs to uh, maintain um, a room temperature uh, from 200 degrees. And I found this very interesting. So yeah, this is pretty much the uh, bug or feature discussion. Uh, should Charcoal and coal <coughs> provide you with a different uh, exhaust uh, temperature. Hmm, very interesting. Um, what I also would like to use this video for is uh, as a reference for how much charge is uh, generated from the solid generator for each um, piece of coal and charcoal. And it turns out there is a little bit of a discrepancy, this, um, yeah, a difference, uh, yeah, there's a little bit of a difference. So let's uh, see how this goes. Um, for this I would like to have a reference, uh, hang on, and makes a battery, hang on, battery, let's spell it right, uh, it's already selected, right, so a new battery, uh, we have to, yeah, this, it's all right. Right, let's see. So I have set I have set the stacker to stack size one. Um, let's start with the coal. Um, split one, and let's see. So one piece of coal. How much charge is uh, is generated by one piece of coal? And um, where is my tablet? Give me my tablet. Right here. So as you can see, 200,000 uh, charge um, you you get from from one coal. The interesting part is uh, the coal is processed in ticks. So one tick is uh, half a second, and it needs 10 ticks to process uh, one piece of coal. Um, let me show you this. Hang on. Stack one. Uh, give me you. As you can see, here yeah, uh, 20,000 uh, per tick, and as you can see, now we are at 400,000. So 10 ticks. Uh, the coal is processed in 10 ticks. Right. Let's get rid of the <coughs> of the battery here. Let's make a new one, and let's check this for the charcoal. Right, so for this we need you, and we split, hang on, we split one charcoal. Right, so let's see, one charcoal, and let's see what happens. 
As you can see, it also pro is processed in ticks of 20,000 and one piece of charcoal will give you 120,000 charge, which is very interesting, I found, because yeah, charcoal is very easy to get. You uh, plant some rice, uh, you get a lot of uh, rice, you make it uh, to a biomass and you will get uh, a lot of charcoal and uh, yeah, so one piece of charcoal 120,000. Right. So far so good. Now comes the reference or the interesting part. Let's see how the solid generator handles stack sizes. Um, for this I would like to adjust the stack size to 5. I would like to change the battery here so we have a re better reference. And let's see. So let's start with the coal. Uh, no. <coughs> so a stack of five five coals. <coughs> oh, sorry. Yeah. So five coal, and if you remember uh, the two hundred thousand, it should result in a charge of one million. Yeah. Um, so as far as my observations go, um, this should be this should be okay. Yeah. So it should result in 100,000 charge. Here we go. So you put a stack of coal inside, and the solid generator is capable of processing the whole coal in its ticks. Right. Very interesting. Now. And here comes the uh, aqua feature discussion. Uh, the charcoal. What happens if you grab a stack of a stack of charcoal and you process it by a, <coughs> by a full stack size of let's see five? It should result in uh, six hundred thousand uh, charge. Let's see what happens. And as you can see, the solid generator cannot process charcoal. Um, hang on, we need a little bit light. <coughs> it cannot uh, process the charcoal. Um, you should you should have six hundred thousand charge from from uh, five uh, charcoal, but you only get two hundred thousand because the solid generator is for some reason not processing the charcoal in ticks. Um, <coughs> and if you remember, uh, one charcoal uh, is processed in six ticks, um, but uh, the solid generator cannot handle this. Right, now you might think, well, no problem. I set the stack size to one here and feed the, you know, let's uh, adjust our reference here. You set the stack, stacker to stack size one, and uh, well, uh, the solid generator can uh, is now getting only pieces of one so, uh, uh, charcoal. Let's see what happens. Do we get now our six? As you can see, um, even if you feed the, the solid generator uh, one piece after another, you will not get the 600,000 um, charge you would expect uh, from one piece of coal. So you need a little bit of logic to adjust uh, your solid generator control um, to get uh, the full charge of the uh, for the charcoal. Um, I think this is a little bit of a bug or feature discussion. <coughs> Um, I don't think it is intended, but uh, maybe it is uh, something you have to uh, to deal with, and uh, it encourages you to uh, to make actually some uh, solid generator control. Um, yeah, I think uh, anything else? No, I think this is it. Um, yeah, I keep it here. Uh, like I said, this is a reference for 
mostly myself. Uh, so uh, future iterations for the solid generator, maybe uh, I can see the difference um, uh, when I make this test a little bit later again. Um, how things have changed, um, especially the temperature. Uh, temperature is very interesting in my book. Um, and the other thing is a little bit of an oddity. Um, yeah, right. Um, in general, the solid generator is not very uh, common or not very loved, uh, if you want to call it like this. Um, I can understand uh, why this is. Um, in my book, it is an <coughs> it is a starter item. Uh, so I mostly use it as a starter item, and in the beginning of your base building, you would only need uh, at maximum 2,000 kilowatt. And uh, maybe the general, uh, uh, maybe in yeah, maybe a discussion where the solid generator should. Uh, uh, yeah, sit between all the other uh, power generators. Um, maybe uh, this discussion uh, yeah, is needed as well. Anyway, uh, let's keep it like this. Uh, I hope you have a good day and see you, mate.